Earthbed. Greetings, Earth enthusiasts. Welcome back to Earth Pen. Today, we're delving into the captivating world of geology to explore an essential topic, active and inactive faults. Join me as we uncover the science behind these geological features, their implications for our planet, and the importance of understanding them. Introduction to Faults Let's begin with the basics. Faults are fractures in the Earth's crust where rocks on either side have moved relative to each other. They are critical to the study of tectonic plate movement and the Earth's dynamic processes. Active faults. Active faults are those that have experienced movement in recent geological history, typically within the last 10. 000 years. They are potential sources of seismic activity, including earthquakes. Causes of active faults. The movement along active faults is driven by the immense forces generated by the collision and movement of tectonic plates. This stress builds up over time and is eventually released in the form of an earthquake. Earthquake hazard zones. Active faults are often found in earthquake-prone areas, known as earthquake hazard zones. Understanding their locations and behaviors is crucial for earthquake preparedness and risk mitigation. Inactive faults. Inactive faults, on the other hand, have not experienced recent movement and are not currently a source of seismic activity. However, they provide valuable insights into past geological processes. Geological records. Inactive faults leave behind geological records, such as fault scraps and offset features, that help geologists reconstruct the Earth's history and the movements of tectonic plates. Importance of study. Studying both active and inactive faults is essential for understanding the Earth's geological history, predicting potential seismic hazards, and designing structures that can withstand earthquakes. Safety and preparedness. Living in areas near active faults means being prepared for earthquakes. Emergency plans, earthquake-resistant buildings, and public awareness are vital components of safety. In conclusion, active and inactive faults are windows into the Earth's geological past and future. They remind us of the dynamic nature of our planet and the importance of preparedness. Thanks for joining us today on Earth Pen. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts or questions about active and inactive faults in the comments below. Until next time, keep exploring the wonders of our ever-changing Earth. Once again, this is Earth Pen. Learning has never been this easy for anyone, anywhere.